In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to stream on Google Classroom. Streaming in Google Classroom can be an excellent way to engage with your students, share announcements, or highlight important educational content in real time. Whether you're a beginner or have been using Google Classroom for a while, this guide will walk you through the process step by step. Let's begin by navigating to google.com. It's the gateway to all things Google and from here you'll be able to access Google Classroom alongside the plethora of services Google offers. Once you're on google.com, comma, you'll notice a sign in button at the top right corner of the page. Click on it. This is the first step toward accessing your Google Classroom. After clicking on sign in, you'll be asked to choose your Google account. This should be the account associated with your teaching activities or the one provided by your educational institution. If you have multiple Google accounts, make sure to select the one that has access to Google Classroom. Next, you'll be prompted to type in your password for the selected Google account. Take your time to ensure you enter it correctly to avoid any access issues. Once you've entered your password, click on Next to proceed. Following your successful sign-in, direct your attention to the top right corner of the Google homepage again, but this time, Look out for the Google Apps menu. It's represented by a grid of dots and is a doorway to all the services accessible under your Google account. Click on it. Within the Apps menu, you'll find the Google Classroom app. Click on it to step into the world of Google Classroom. It's a space where educators and students interact, learn and share educational resources efficiently. Upon clicking the Google Classroom app, you'll be taken to your Classroom dashboard. This is the control center for all your educational activities on Google Classroom. From here, you can access different classes you're teaching or administrating. Now it's time to get to the streaming part. In the Classroom interface, locate and click on the Stream tab. The stream is essentially the news feed of your classroom where you can post announcements, assignments, questions, and more. It's a great way to engage your students and keep them informed about class activities. Once in the Stream tab, look for the option that says Announce something to your class. This is your key to creating a new post or announcement in your classroom stream. Clicking this will open up a text box where you can type in your message or announcement. This could be anything from a uh, welcome message, assignment reminders, or even a brief on what the day's lesson will entail. As you type in your announcement, think about the clarity and purpose of your message. This is your moment to grab your students' attention and convey important information. Once you're satisfied with your message, it's time to make it public to your class. Look for the post button and click on it. Your announcement will now be visible to all the students subscribed to your classroom. Congratulations, you've just learned how to stream on Google Classroom. Making announcements is a straightforward process, but it's a powerful tool for maintaining communication with your class and ensuring everyone is on the same page. A few tips before we wrap up. Always double check your post for any typos or errors before hitting post and consider the timing of your announcements. You want to make sure the information is timely and relevant to your students' current needs. That's all for today's tutorial on how to stream on Google Classroom. I hope you found this guide helpful and you're now more comfortable with making announcements in your classroom stream. Remember, the key to a successful classroom stream is consistent, clear communication. Whether it's a daily check-in, weekly summaries, or important reminders, your presence in the stream lets your students know you're engaged and available. Feel free to revisit any of the steps mentioned in this video whenever you need a refresher and don't hesitate to explore more features within Google Classroom to enhance your teaching and your students' learning experiences. Thank you for joining me today, and here's to your success in creating an engaging and informative classroom stream.